What I have here is a redundancy bus 10 from Free Sky. This will take two power sources and two receivers to create a redundancy system for your model aircraft. You can link two Free Sky X series receivers. I will be using the X8R. Go ahead and separately bind the two receivers. On receiver one, allow telemetry when you bind it and do not allow telemetry when you bind receiver number two. You can do this on the X8R by jumping the signal pins of channel three and four with the included jumper. Plug into receiver number one port on the RB10, then plug into the yes bus of receiver number one. Then plug into receiver two port and plug it into the S bus of receiver number two. We are also going to get telemetry through the smart port of receiver number one. In the middle port, plug into the S port, then plug into the smart port of receiver number one to allow telemetry. I'm going to test it by using the spare ESC I have here that I use for testing with the built-in 5 volt BEC. The redundancy bus takes 4 to 8.4 volts of power. So the 5 volt from the ESC here will run the whole system. Plug in the ESC. Looks like we have a solid green on the RB10, a solid green on receiver number 2, and a solid green on receiver number 1. Looks to be all set up here. So now you can solder your connectors for your battery ports, plug in your servos like you normally would on a regular receiver, and install it into your aircraft 